Hey everyone, today we're going to go over how to create a clickable link in Adobe InDesign. If you use this platform to create the printables that you sell for passive income, it is a great idea to be able to add clickable hyperlinks so that people who download your printables can click through for extra resources, your website, or affiliate links so you can earn extra money on your passive income printables. To add a link, you're going to want to select the text that you want to become a link. Then you'll go to Window, Interactive, and down to Hyperlinks. This will bring up the little hyperlinks box that you are going to use to create your link. So you'll just have this text selected, then you will type in the link or copy and paste it and hit enter. This will create a hyperlink with the text that you have selected. So you'll wanna go through your PDF and do this again for each hyperlink that you want to create to make it interactive. And as you see, the hyperlink will become a blue with underline text. This is just the standard default that happens in InDesign. If it doesn't match the style that you want, if you want it to be aesthetically matching your branding, you can go back and edit the text so that the color is what you want. When you do change the text color, the hyperlink still stays, so that will not affect it at all. It just will look more cohesive with your overall PDF branding. However, you may choose just to leave it as the standard hyperlink with the blue text and underline because that's a well-known form of a link, so people that download your printable will know to click on that, likely. But if you are wanting to change the text, you would just do that as you normally change text and select it and then choose the color that you want. The next step for making sure that this works is to select the right type of PDF when you save it. So you will have to select interactive. So Adobe PDF interactive, normally for printables you wanna select print, so it's the highest quality for printing, but to do links, you're going to have to select interactive. That is what makes the links work in Adobe InDesign. So you will have to select that and download it as an interactive PDF. And then once that's downloaded, you'll see that when you open it up, the PDFs that you have created are linkable. You will hover over them and a little hand will come up and that makes the viewer know that it's clickable. So you can click that link and it will take you to the destination that you have chosen to link to. So that's it for InDesign. It is pretty simple, but it is two steps. So you have to remember to do both steps to make sure that the links work and are the best possible interaction for your end user.